Hi guys, my name is Emmy and today I'm going to show you around in Moscow Space Museum. The Memorial Museum of Cosmonautics is one of the Moscow's favorite museum for its visitors, both among the younger generation and adults. The museum location is visible from afar thanks to a 107-meter titanium monument erected in 1964 to the conquerors of outer space. The stalemate of this monument is where the Cosmonautic Museum was opened. Large-scale renovations were completed in 2009 and a greatly expanded exhibition area was opened up that year that shows off space exploration. This is a good way to learn about one of the things that USSR citizens were proudest of, as well as about the legendary status accorded to the first man in space, Yuri Gagarin. Opened in 1981 in honor of the 20th anniversary of the first flight into space made by Yuri Gagarin, the Memorial Museum of Cosmonautics has become legendary thanks to an exhibition area rich in content and a striking exterior. It's impossible to understate the contribution Russia has made to the field of space exploration. This is especially true when it comes to human space exploration. The Russians launched the first satellite, put the first man in space, put the first man in orbit, and they executed the first successful spacewalk. Russia also launched the first woman to space, decades before any other country. Their progress in the space race propelled the U.S. to the moon 50 years ago. Today, Russian Soyuz rockets carry astronauts from around the world to the International Space Station. The museum exposition gives a retrospect on how Soviet space science evolved starting from first man-made satellites, subsequently followed by the first manned spaceflight, first spacewalks, moon exploration programs, solar system exploration programs, and international space research programs. Intricate interior design and unusual exposition altogether created a unique individuality of the museum. However, new time set, new standards, 25 years since its first opening, the museum has been closed down for a massive renovation. Now, the museum shows all the newly accumulated information and latest technologies. The museum has an area of 4,500 square meter with 8 exhibition halls, presents the history of space exploration. Among the most interesting exhibits you can find, the model of the first artificial Earth satellite, famous space dogs Vilka and Strilka, the Soyuz spacecrafts, and the full-scale model of the core model of the Mir Orbital Space Station. I know walking in the museum can sometimes be boring. So, how to make your trip to the museum even more interesting? Well, here are some tips. Choose and book your guide tour. Tours are conducted for all age categories in Russian and English. If you want to experience what the real cosmonauts feels, book a training session aboard the Soyuz TMA spacecraft simulator Exactly the same simulator is used for training cosmonauts at Yuri Gagarin Cosmonaut Training Center. Wow, that's really interesting. You can also try the Museum Audio Guide in Russian, English, Spanish, and Chinese. Audio Guide costs 200 rubles. The Audio Guide can be paid at the cash desk in the museum. 
can also buy your museum tickets at the ticket office or at the museum website online. The cost of the undiscounted ticket is 300 rubles. Another interesting thing in this museum is that you can also buy real space food especially manufactured for the International Space Station crew members in the cafe under the rocket. It was produced by the Bilyolubsky Experimental Plant and the Cosmopit Company. Space food makes a great presence or memorable souvenir. After you've seen the museum exhibition, make sure to visit the museum gift shop for the inspiration for yourself and your friends. It was proven by many that you can take a bit of space with you. So guys, if you plan to visit the museum, take note about the opening hours. The Museum of Cosmonautics open on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 10 o'clock in the morning and close at 7 o'clock in the evening. And during Thursday and Saturday, they open at 10 o'clock in the morning and close at 9 o'clock in the evening. And during Thursday and Saturday, the museum start to open at 10 o'clock in the morning and close at 9 o'clock in the evening. So guys, this is the end of our Space Museum virtual tour. I hope that everybody have fun and enjoyed watching. So if you like this kind of videos, please consider to like, share, and subscribe into my small channel. And I'll see you on my next video. Keep safe everyone!